Hi there, over the last year I started feeling very tired, lack of energy or motivation to do anything. Uh, it was convenient to blame it on having little kids and exercising pretty often, like five to six times uh, per week. I recently changed to exercising every second day. You're so goddamn lazy! What the hell's wrong with you? And there's a limit how much we can actually blame on the little kids, right? <laughs> anyway, no matter how much I slept, I was always tired and it was really hard to go through a day without a nap. On top of that, when we are tired, we have bigger appetites and it's hard to stop one from devouring everything. Uh, it also makes it easier to reach out for sweets. Uh, over, over the years of stumbling upon different videos, it was hard to avoid topic related to diets and it's no secret that everyone will promote the diet as yeah my, my diet is the best it's number one diet so everyone will claim it's based on studies but what can we actually verify today uh, there's so much information online without proper education we won't be sure what's correct and what's not if the information is closer to our beliefs uh, we, are, we are more likely to believe it and actually we will want to believe that it's true and I know that in my case it's a good time to verify some of that information uh, some of the results are very tempting uh, so because of that I decided to try two of the extreme diets so I'll be going vegan for 30 days <laughs> You serious? I will have a short break, a break because we will have relatives visiting, and after that I will go carnivore for 30 days. You're mad. Um, I'm hoping to give regular updates on how it's affecting me, possibly once a week. I believe that both of those diets will be pretty hard for me. I'm a meat lover. I like my steaks. Not to mention my loaf for cheese and other dairy products. And on the vegan diet I will have those completely eliminated. But I will be able to eat carbs and other snacks and sweets. So, so I'm not expecting to lose much weight or any weight at all. But it will be probably different on the carnivore diet as I won't be allowed any sweets or carbs. So it will, I, will, I will probably end up losing a decent amount of weight. And in both of those diets I would like to have a pretty decent approach. And I know that when it comes to the vegan diet I will still be snacking and eating some sweets. but. I will try to reduce the amount and my focus will be on having decent meals as it's not a problem to eat rice or pasta all the time and claim to be vegan, right? But there is no nutrition to, in that and that would do only harm and the same thing goes for the carnivore diet, right? We could only eat lean steaks and lean meat all the time but that would be... but we wouldn't be providing any fuel for our bodies because, because where would our body get energy from, right? Without proper fats. So one would end up with a huge weight loss, but it would also be terrible for the well-being. I am no nutrition specialist, although I know a few things. I was, I was pretty interested in the topic for the last few years. And unfortunately, knowing that something is bad uh, doesn't mean we will stop ourselves from doing it, right? So having a good knowledge doesn't make us healthy by default. To be fair, I'm already on the fourth day of the vegan diet. I just had no energy to record anything properly. I tried to, but it didn't end up well. Uh, we got back on Saturday evening from Poland after over two weeks of vacation. And because I was in vacation mode, I was eating way <laughs> too much. Uh, so on Sunday I sat down, planned my vegan meals for the whole week, uh, got groceries, and 
to be able to start properly from Monday. So I started on Monday 11th of September and my 30 days of veganism will finish on the 10th of October. Uh, if you lasted this long, please let me know in the comments below which diet you think I will prefer more, which will have better results. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.